The Nigeria Upstream Petroleum Regulatory Commission has advised multinational companies operating in the oil and gas sector to upgrade their facilities in order to ensure that they are smartly controlled. The no controller of the commission, Godde Ine, said this during a visit with representatives of multinationals operating the Obiafo gas well in Ibeocha community, Oba Ibeman, Doniloka government area. The visit follows the gas leak well head fire incident on the 15th of November, which lasted till the 14th of January 2022, said to have been caused by sabotage. Ine called on members of the community to be calm as the commission is working with the Nigerian oil company owners of the sabotage facility and will address the situation situation that led to the incident. What is important is a comprehensive report of the incident is expected from the company so that uh, we can now submit that. After such a report, what is most important to us is how can we remedy the environment so that uh, we can at least get to the original basic the baseline that the environment used to be. In a set, smartly controlled oil and gas facilities will eliminate human interference and incessant fire outbreak, noting that the Commission will support robust modern technologies to eliminate such interferences in the oil and gas sector. If this is a smart well, for example, it could have been controlled from the control room and shot it without fiscally deploying all the methods they have used. Going forward, I want NAOC and any other operating companies with the type of trend, security trends around us, we will suggest that the wells should be as smart as possible so that we eliminate uh, human interference. Such work can also be shot in remotely from our offices. Correspondent Abiyadon Yusuf reports that an official of the company said a faceless group had taken responsibility for sabotaging the Obiafo well.